Welcome back. I'm joined now by member of the Quilt Guild, Kathy Menzi. Kathy, thanks so much for joining us this Thursday morning. Thank you. Thanks for inviting us. Really appreciate having you over here. Well, we've got the Quilt Show just around the corner on Saturday and Sunday this upcoming weekend. What's in store for attendees this year? We have over 150 quilts. Uh, we have a silent auction that benefits the Center for Safety and Empowerment. And we have vendors and we also have a boutique that you can get homemade items for great gifts. A lot of uh, great options there. And are these some examples of uh, the upcoming yes. quilts of that, that 150 here? Yes. So I'm the featured quilter this year, which uh, which means I have a, a special section for, for, for my quilts. Um, we have generally traditional quilts, but I'm more of an art quilter. So that's what I've, I've brought today to show you some of the art quilts that yeah. I do. And we'll try and show these off a little here. And while I'm doing this, how did you get involved with quilting in the first place? This is beautiful, by the way. Oh, my goodness. Well, when I decided to retire, I decided I wanted to take a class in quilting, and it was a wonderful thing. <laughs> <laughs> how long have you been doing this for here? Since 2016. 2016. Oh, my goodness. That, absolutely incredible. And how long have you been a member of the, the quilt group here in the uh, local since community? Since about that time, too. No yeah. kidding. Yeah. Is, is this your first time really being uh, with this event here? It, this is, um, yeah, one of, the, one of the first times to do this kind of for me to do this kind of event. So yeah, this is, it's, but we're really looking forward to it. It's, it's a great time, it's really fun. And the so many talented quilters that make absolutely beautiful, beautiful quilts. Yeah, so. absolutely. I mean, if this is any indication to go off of, the, <laughs> this event is gonna be absolutely incredible here. Well, you mentioned there that there will also be a silent auction with 100% mm -hmm. of the proceeds being donated. Can I have you talk about what that silent auction supports in the local area? Okay, so the silent auction will have, um, I don't know, 30 or 40 different uh, items, a lot of sewn items, a lot of, some quilts and things that will benefit the Center for Safety and Empowerment. There That's you go. one of our um, a very important areas that we donate to every year. It, it, you know, one of the things about this quilt show is it's really, it's really a fundraiser for us and it allows us to do a lot of things for the community. We, we donate to make quilts for the Quilts of Valor for oh, people wow. who are in the military. Uh, we also make quilts for hospitals, for hospice, and for a couple of other places that um, people can use a, a quilt, especially at a, at a difficult time. Yeah, exactly. That's pretty incredible. The I didn't know that local uh, connection there. Yeah. That's, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. Well, if you were to you know reach out to anybody out there in the community, quilter or non-quilter, what would you say to encourage them to stop by that event this weekend? It's a fun event. I mean, there's lots of things going on, um, and it's just, it's, it's almost like just going to an, a place where they have art. I mean, it's yeah. just gorgeous with, you know, bright colors and wonderful, wonderful patterns, things to see. Definitely. I can't, I can't wait to see more. Looking forward to that upcoming event here. Thank well, you. Kathy, thank you again for joining us this morning here. We really appreciate that look at this year's quilt show. Thank you. Of thank course. You. And for more information, head over to kscapitalquilters.com.